Day 62 of Season of Nonviolence. When we see that we have gone wrong, it is our duty to retrace our footsteps and proceed again by the right path. Gandhi. One of the painful realities of being human is that we make mistakes. It, it's really not a question of whether we make a mistake, it's simply a question of when we make a mistake and how serious it will be. Then it's a question of what we do about it. If we are able to take responsibility for our mistakes and reverse course, no harm has been done. When we are unable to admit our mistakes and take responsibility for it, that mistake can lead us down the wrong path in our work, in our lives, and in our relationships. But Gandhi is telling us that taking responsibility for our error is not just a way to keep us on the right path, it is also our duty. When he talks about the right path, he is talking about the path of our lives, but he is also talking about the nonviolent path. When we make a mistake and admit it, we have returned to the nonviolent path. When we don't admit it, we continue on the path that takes us down. We have, for all practical purposes, taken the path of violence. Making an error and failing to admit it amounts to a lie. Lying is always violence. Violence to the truth, violence to those we lie to, and violence to the relationship. The worst violence, however, is the violence we do to ourselves. When we lie to others about anything, we are hiding the truth about ourselves from them. When people don't know the truth about us, we do not give them the opportunity to care about who we really are. When we do that, we are doing violence to the very idea of the relationship that we think exists. This is true whether we are talking about personal relationships, social relationships, work relationships, or any other. When we err and do not own our mistake but hide it, we damage all the relationships involved. The violence we do to ourselves in not retracing our steps and telling the truth about our error always takes us even further off the right path. When this happens, whatever the goal we are seeking is further from our reach rather than closer. Only when we admit we have gotten off track, turn back and take the right path again can we attain whatever goal we have been seeking. Affirmative practice. Today, I will meditate on my mistakes and how I've handled them. Today, I will admit when I have been wrong and make the amends that put me back on the right path. This is the path of nonviolence.